All right, we have a story from Ross Gadotti on some hazing allegations. The very tail end of last week, it was brought to our attention by the, uh, the Greater Latrobe School District that they appears they had an incident that took place uh, between members of the junior high wrestling team. The exact nature and details of the incident are not being released as of yet, but it is apparently warranted what's now become a full-scale criminal investigation. I would say that we would probably call it a somewhat of an assault that they believe took place. We're provided some physical evidence consisting of like, some video, uh, video evidence, and we've been working and conducting several interviews and have a long way to go. District Superintendent Dr. Georgia Tepper releasing a statement on the incident saying in part, quote, there is an ongoing investigation involving a hazing incident with the junior high wrestling team. All section wrestling matches have been completed. Two exhibition tournaments and an exhibition match have been canceled due to the investigation. Dr. Tepper also making clear in this letter that, quote, we assure our school community that the district is taking all appropriate actions necessary. As for the state police. If we're able to uh, see that there is uh, information or evidence that would arise to a crime, then the people that committed those crimes will be charged. All right, regarding the coaches, a lot of rumors going on right now in and around Lake Trobe as to what happened to the coaching staff. They were let go, but I spoke to the parents, or the parent of one of the coaches spoke to me on a condition of anonymity. He told me that that's not unusual. At the end of every season, the coaches are let go. Either the same staff comes on the next year or a new staff is hired. As details become available, we'll, of course, pass them on to you. Reporting live, Ross Gennady, KDKA News.